thought you was on some bullshit. That nigga got mad as hell. Nice. I'll yeah. never forget that shit. That nigga got mad, boy. Talk the shit out of me, man. Yeah. Oh, you alright? Is we on? From the east to the west side, get it, girl. That's fine. I got one. That's fine. Uh, I think Wale. Tell me she wants it. She know I know that she with it. Wanna get it? Get it? Get it? Get it? Get it? Sexy, dang. Enough to make it. Go crazy, man, do crazy. Then we get the talking and touching, we get the licking and sticking. And now you know what we doing when you're around and we miss it. We go to perfect positions, yeah, no, no. we get it popping. Now listen, too much pleasure. The message you got the power. We, we make a way, we make a way. Check, pop, chop, chop. Yeah, I'm the way. I mean, throw your money. I'll be on the other one. That XPK heartbreak kid fish. Go on, don't play this shot, this. I'm a pro with the woody amateurs. Make a buzz a few times when I come through. You must smoke a bunny cake like Kung Fu. You're going crazy. You're shooting with a light in five seconds. Two, three, two, one. <laughs> Yo, you know what it is, man. Six thirty on your dial, straight from the E block. We about to go, I think. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> Alright, we gotta try this again, though. Obviously, we are wrong. We just, I guess, we just really wasn't ready. Alright, so you know what it is. Six thirty on your dial, straight from the E block. Let's go. <laughs>
<laughs> we all messed up in this joint. Yo, 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 you know what it is. It's your boy, the Hood Howard Stern, Q Lewis. Mug Money. Yo, shout out to Hot Topic. And you are now locked in to the livest cloud radio show on the planet. Yeah. Straight from the E-Block. You know what it is, man. Lock it down. It's Tuesday. You know what it is. 6.30 every Tuesday. We right here. All in your grill. You feel me? And it's been a long weekend, so we got to go through the crew. See what went down this weekend, dog. So we're going to start off with Young Shy, the lady killer. <laughs> Hot topics. <laughs> whatever you want to call them. <laughs> <laughs> right. What's going on? Have your head go real quick. <laughs> <laughs> this, this Get your was, head cracked. <laughs> this was a funny weekend, man. Very, very funny weekend. Well, why was it a funny weekend? Well, you know, I had Smart a ass. couple of arguments for unnecessary reasons. <laughs> I really don't understand. And, uh, yeah, man, somebody on the show just need not to call me no more, dog. <laughs> like, when, 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 when gatherings happen, clubs or whatever, I'm going to be sleeping now. <laughs> you going to be sleeping? You don't want no company? Yeah, I want no company, dog. I'm going to punish me. <laughs> yeah, man, just, you know, besides that, I ain't do too much, man. Just chilled around. Watched some games on Sunday. Yeah. Ate a gang of Dorito tacos. Mm-hmm. That's about it, man. Besides the uh, unnecessary yeah, uh, gathering yeah. uh, Saturday night, yeah. everything was pretty straight. <laughs> so what what exactly happened Saturday night, though? I mean, Hood Howard Stern had uh, hit me up. Since you want to put everybody on blast. <laughs> he hit me up with John talking about let's go to Lucky's in Southfield. We went there, man. We just, dog, I just, I don't know, man. I guess I outgrew the club, man. It was just whack. Everybody in there was whack. My man got his car busted open for his TV. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. <laughs> it was just, I don't know. I, I would be very off in my grandma's basement just chilling, watching the game, dog. <laughs> chilling, watching the game. Yeah, man. That's, so, that's what's up, man. You know, I mean, Hood House Stone used to be a party animal. Yeah, it used to be a long time ago. <laughs> many, many moons ago. I had dreams of chilling with him. <laughs> I mean, back in the day, we used to do our thing, though. You feel me? I'm like a for real old school player, though. Like, back in the day, we really used to do We used to get it in, though. For it's real. all good, though. It's all good, man. Yeah. We, we, all, we all good. Yeah, every hustler have his heyday, yeah. I guess. It, yeah. it, was, it was just a chill weekend, man. That's about it. Yeah, that's, that's about it, though. We ain't had nothing else popping off. No, no, nothing else. Right, that's what's up, man. What about you, Mom? One? Man, I work, dog. Nah, I worked 14 <laughs> days straight. 14 days straight. I ain't saw a basketball game, bro. Oh, word? Ain't you ain't seen none of the games? Nothing. Hey, <laughs> so you ain't see D-Rose just fuck his knee all up. I ain't seen nothing. Yeah, that shit was terrible. I ain't seen nothing. I don't know nothing about nothing. <laughs> Only thing I know when it pop up on my screen on my phone. Right. <laughs> right. I ain't seen nothing, bro. <laughs> Locked up for like a jail. Hey, well, that's what's up, though. Yeah. Oh. Definitely what's up. <laughs> Hey, so, <laughs> hey, so look, we just having a fucked up day. All right, so I've just been notified that there was no sound. <laughs> so we're going to start <laughs> over again. Bro. I've just been notified. Thank you for the caller to let me know that there is no sound in the studio. Uh, we have rectified that issue. All right, so if you're on, if you on, if you on you stream right now, you're going to have to listen to this same shit again because our microphones were inactive at the time. So, uh. How was your weekend, yo? <laughs> Tell us what went down with you, bro. <laughs> Cause we gotta do this all over again, obviously. Oh shit, man, not too much happened, man. Nothing at all. <laughs> this is one shit popping up. I was just on chill, man. Dude. Went to a whack club. Had whack time. Club. Whack time. Okay. Uh, how I started lose my number once again. <laughs> for those who missed it. <laughs> right. And uh, watched the basketball games. Oh yeah, and I hoop Sunday. Oh yeah, how was that, dog? I ain't go with your with your brother. I should have, man. Where I went, it was just awful. It was uh, awful. I I was winded because it'd been a minute, but I was pretty straight though, man. Everybody else was pretty horrible. <laughs> it made me look too good. <laughs> I feel like I could compete with anybody, knowing I really can't right right now. But you on your way back? Yeah, I'm straight. I, was, yeah. I can see it, man. I can feel it. I'm you there. Feel it? I'm on. I'm on four. You on? You on four? Are you trying to get to ten? <laughs> yeah, I'm on ten. From four. Man, I was still balling, dog. <laughs> I was still, tired, man. I was winded. I'm still hustling. My jump that's, shot, that's a long way. My jump shot was falling. I played a lot of defense, then go back on offense. <laughs> right. I was good, though, man. Yeah, that's how it <laughs> Let everybody run down. Go! <laughs> right. Go! <laughs> like, I'm going to stay back on D. Run. You know, run at offense. Right. Run. Yeah, yeah. I'm making a comeback, though. All right. That's what's up, man. Mama, you say <laughs> you say you just worked the whole weekend. I huh? worked, dog. Yeah. Ain't did nothing, ain't seen nothing, ain't. 
I saw a good movie though. It's called Meet Evil, dog, with Samuel Jackson, bro. Meet Evil. Meeting Evil. Oh, for real? Yeah, it was pretty good, mm-hmm. bro. Yeah, I ain't yeah. never heard of crazy it's shit. It's probably not out yet, though. I don't know. Yeah, probably not out yet. Kind of my man gets it in. Yes, he does. On the bootleg. <laughs> yeah, I got some uh, bad copies. Yeah, yeah. right. I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm did still kind of mad yeah, about that. Detroit movies that was in Atlanta. Hey, done a bitch, man. Yeah, but um, shit, me and myself, man, we just gonna piggyback on on hot topics, man. Like like he was saying, we did experience a a pretty whack time at uh at Lucky's in Southfield. Uh, shout out, but not really to Lucky's in Southfield. <laughs> I do want to give a shout out to my BFF uh, Alicia Miss Queen King though, uh, and my bro uh, Eric, who uh, they both graduated from Eastern Michigan over the weekend. So congratulations! That's what's up. Congratulations to them. You know, what I'm saying college graduates in the house. Uh, also, uh, also a shout out, of course, uh, to uh, my my special friend who is also uh, graduating this weekend. Uh, we won't put her on blast though, cause she get real nervous. Click that phone. Congratulations. Yeah, congratulations. congratulations. Yeah, we ain't gonna put her on blast, cause she get all nervous and you know I don't want her to choke me enough the next time she see me. But um, anyway, let me see outside of that. What was crazy though about my man though when we went down to uh Lucky's on on uh on Saturday, the dude like at the truck next to me window all bust out when he come out. They had stole his TVs or whatever out the out the uh, out the visors. What you say? Yeah, I think yeah. they had visors. Yeah, what's funny though, he said that uh he got like some bigger TVs in the back and they ain't even take though. <laughs> I guess long. yeah, they took the ones. I guess they might have maybe maybe security actually did their job and scared them off. I don't know what happened. Something, yeah, but anyway. It was extra whack though. And I just wanna I just wanna say something to the ladies though. Oh, in real life. So if, if the dudes you don't expect the dude to show up at Lucky's with with his Nike flip flops on and a do rag. <laughs> so Bitch, I need to understand, and, and, and I use that I, I use that term with endearment. Um, <laughs> bitch, how you think you gonna show up to the club with your with your with your Kim's Beauty Supply flip flops on? Yeah, where where they do that know, at, dog? Man. And you know, at this point, dog, in real life, Lucky's and Southfield supposedly not a hood bar. So even if you got on some some Fendi uh, flip flops, bitch, I'm gonna need you not to wear flip flops to the club. Man, I, I don't man. care if they. They could be Gucci flip flops, dog. They flip flops. There's a lot of nose I seen out there, dog. A lot of yeah. stuff. Oh, girl working it real hard in the Air Force Ones. Hey, that's that's cool. You know what I'm saying? But no. I I can't really. I'm not feeling the gym shoe girl in the club. That's not cool, dog. I, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just not. I, I just need to see a pair of heels, man. Yeah, I mean we had luckies in Southfield. Like I I, I, mean, I you're thought you're the club and you grow period. Yeah, you, you grow like, like we ain't at the 18 and up. Just for like chilling. Chilling. Yeah. Going to the mall. Going to basketball games. <laughs> Right, you all just chilling. He's the one that was, no, I mean, even if we was just at a hood bar, like if we was at the tipping in, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to the east side. I still east side. All my niggas don't know about tipping in. But yeah, if you at the tipping in, I, I'm all right with you being there in gym shoes because nine times out of ten, if I'm in the tipping in, I don't really want to fuck with you anyway. I'm just kind of there kicking it probably with a couple of homies. But um, yeah, dog, that, that shit was crazy. That shit was extra whack. Um, I, I, I feel like really I could have went to the one down in Jefferson. At least I know it's hood and I'm, I'm used to it. Right. See, I thought I went out to South. I thought, you know, you know, excuse me. I thought you West Side girls was doing something. Oh, thanks for thinking. Yeah, yeah, I, I shouldn't have thought that. I think I grew with the club, though. I think I did so much in, like, a two-year span every weekend. Yeah, yeah I guess what it is. Like same, you see the same niggas doing the same shit. Same, right. Same hoes. Same, same shit. Same shit. Yeah, I guess yeah, it do right. get played out. Niggas, yeah. like, the same club songs, niggas. <laughs> Play what? Ice Will, boss up, get his money, niggas get his money. <laughs> Bitch, you pulling titties out, don't need titties be don't, out. Titties don't need to be out. Yeah. Hey, but look, though, real quick before we uh, move on to the uh, to the topic, man, I do want to mention, man, you know, uh, somebody got somebody got carjacked last night on 8 Mile and Gratch, right? Now, they had already, they had already uh, carjacked somebody else, stole a car, rolled up on these people on 8 Mile and Gratch, dog, with an AR-15. Damn. Right, wait, wait. So they pull out the AR-15 to ride to to take the car. These motherfuckers don't give up their car, right? So they chase them, right? These these people drive to the Harbor Woods Police Station. Dog, they chasing them on the lawn of the police station, dog. What the hell? Shoot them? <laughs> they had shot. They had shot at them on Eight Mile and Grass. Then they just chased them. Like, dude, really though? Like, if I pull up in the 
in the in the police station, dog. That's was the, it that serious? That's just one that got away. That's just one that got away, that dog. Is that serious? serious? That's what you call taking the plan all the way to the fullest, man. Oh man, that's you got an AR-15 and you trying to rob these oh, motherfuckers. Man. Probably they didn't even say what kind of car it was. They probably was in an Impala or something. That's ridiculous. <laughs> so that you could have just tapped on the window and made a nigga come up out to that shit. Yeah, hey, I don't know. I, these people get a date, man. They get out of control. Like how how do you how do you carjack somebody with a semi-automatic weapon though? No, that shit is for killing. They ain't for robbing no, nobody. No. Man, that shit just I don't know. Makes it a little scary, man. But you know, fuck it, whatever. But anyway, back to the weak ass club. Though. The club was so weak. I'm not ever going there again. But like I said, I just want to give a, a shout out and congratulations to uh, Alicia and my boy E for uh, graduating from uh, from Eastern this this weekend. But uh, yeah, if you graduate again, don't ever invite me to Lucky. So anyway, ever 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 ever. But um, yeah. All right, so let's just get out because I don't even want to talk about it no more. I'm about to get an attitude, trying to get mad. But then I guess like, what's the point though, right? Because if if I was going to the club anyway, like I was going to celebrate the you know the the uh, college graduation, but it ain't like I was going to look for some love up in the club anyway. Right, though, right, I right, guess, right. Yeah. right? I mean, even though it is possible, I guess you you could find your soulmate up in there, or whatever. I, I don't know. I don't it, know. It, it depends on what type of people y'all t- y'all are though. If yeah. Y'all just chilling. Come across each other. Mm-hmm. You know, ain't that type of just be all uh, party hard. Y'all just actually go out and have a you know straight time with your with your boys and your homegirls. Yeah. I mean, and then sometimes some people like I ain't never done this, but sometimes some people you know in a couple in a relationship or whatever they they go out to the club together. Me personally, I, I, I'm uh, you not doing it. No, I mean I don't like clubs anyway. Anyway, yeah, bro. that's true. I haven't been to a club in a in a long time, bro. Yeah. Motherfucker wanted to meet me, but I catch me at the grocery store. <laughs> <laughs> catch me at the grocery store. I ain't going to my club. Yeah, so I get the bar scene, you know. Yeah. Take the lady out to the bar scene. But going to the club is no no. It's a club with a bunch of single, sweaty motherfuckers and shit. Yeah, yeah they go. It's 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 a, too you much. Ask, you ask for trouble. Yeah, that's how motherfucker pull on your chick too many yeah. times. Yeah, it's gonna be a problem. Yeah, I'm blowing yeah. it to somebody. And that's how T eighty five takes it. Skip, skip. Yeah, right. Skip. Right. I mean, I ain't, you know, I ain't got no problem unless a nigga's just real disrespectful. Cause I know at the end of the night she come home with me. Understandable. And after we leave the club, I'm gonna smash because it's my girl. Yeah. <laughs> and then that's really what we was talking about today, anyway. So if you've been following <laughs> us on Twitter or on Facebook, you know what today's topic is. If you are, uh, if you're a couple in a relationship, should you still be using a rubber? That's what we're talking about today, man. Should you still be using condoms, man? Yo, we got callers on deck though. Um... Should we go to the car? How we gonna do it? We gonna go to the car first? Oh, we okay. All right, we 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 we'll take one call and then we gonna go around the, around the floor and see what we got, man. We gonna go to the uh, phone lines real quick. Don't forget if you own UStream, you gotta hit us up seven six zero two eight three forty six forty seven. Hit that number one key if you're on the phone line right now, so you can come on and say your comment. Uh, going to the phone lines, though, I got three one three seven four zero. You on live straight from the E Block? How at your boy? What up, man? Hello? What up, though? 740. It's me. I'm ready to say my time. Hello? 740. Did we lose you? 313 740. <laughs> okay. Okay, we, we'll try it again next time. Uh, looks like she might may have got a little stage fright. I don't know. Uh, uh, 313 740. If you're still on there, hit that number one key again so we know that you want to make a comment. But uh, anyway, we're going to go around the studio real quick and see what the deal is, man. So, young shots, you know how it go. Oh, they'll go first. Yeah, they always got to go first. Okay, so comes with a relationship. Uh, <laughs> so I came up with the topic, man, just you know, just to pat myself on shoulder real quick. <laughs> but uh, I, thought, man, I thought about this one day, man, because I know all the shit be going around. And you really can't always trust your mate. You know, that's, you're not married to that person. But me... I ain't gonna lie, kind of for like the first two or three times, four times, maybe five. <laughs> right. But it, I don't know, when I'm in a relationship, I start, guess I started trusting that person or something. If we in a relationship, you my girl, I'm your nigga. Yeah. So I kind of like, they kind of like go in the garbage and I save my, my money. <laughs> save your money on reference, huh? For some uh, Dorito taco. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, no, at the while, I mean, that's your girl, you should be able to trust her or whatever to not have to wear one. Just, you know, don't, don't make no mistakes and, uh, you know, Knock somebody up real quick. Right. But uh, you should be able to trust them, but you never know. Y'all not married, so she could be doing her little side thing, and you could be doing your little thing, whatever. 
So you never know what you could be bringing back. If that's if you're not faithful in that relationship. Right. But with me, I ain't gonna lie. After like the first couple times, yeah, I stopped. <laughs> Uh, but uh, yeah, hoping that she ain't just. I'm, I'm not oh, she's just saying out there, <laughs> right? You got your your stuff. I gotta be a good girl, niggas. Nigga, in the background, wise. rolling the yeah, dice with a nigga cock. Man. Right. <laughs> <laughs> hoping you don't crap out. Right. I'm yeah. like, like a lot, man. So yeah. you know, yeah. But you know, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, <laughs> what you think, Mark? Me personally, man, I think you should keep a cock on, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, I mean, unless you ready to have kids, you know what I'm saying. Or well, she on the pill? I think. Well, What's she on the pill? Yeah. You don't that know what. Like, yeah. Sure. You ain't on the pill. You can't get no pill. <laughs> <laughs> you get a pill? Yeah. yeah. The AZT mix. Yeah, what they call it? The HIV shit. I don't know what it is, though. You oh, yeah. know what I'm saying? Oh. But I think you should, though, honestly, bro. You know what I'm saying? Just because, like, I know married couples that work common. But my homeboy got twins. And him and his wife. You don't want no more. Stop, <laughs> at, stop at the gas station, dog. For what? Right. Some condoms. You married? Like, so what? I ain't trying to have another set. Yeah, ain't trying to have another set. I don't yeah, you know. Know people think I'll smash anybody just raw dog. <laughs> I ain't been yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I ain't been you in... You want to clear it up? Like, I ain't just smash Everybody think I didn't smash anybody a nigga raw style, but I ain't been in two relationships. And then within those two relationships, I, you know, after a while, that judge just went in the garbage. I mean, yeah, but, yeah. you know, with certain... With my, with my randoms, I never just, you know, I always got the condoms with the randoms. I know, I mean, I mean, I gotta really trust you to go raw, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ooh, baby, I like it raw. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I can't even, I can't even say that. that, that. <laughs> hey, I'm just saying, though, once I get to that point, oh, my jeez. Yeah, but yeah. for <laughs> For the first few months, though, it's, it's all condoms, man. Yeah, yeah boxes yeah, of condoms. Yeah, yeah. But after a while, if you see, me, man. okay, see, that's what, I think that's the problem with black people, though. They just start trusting instead of really knowing yeah. their background and going down there and taking their little tests and seeing what's going on. We just say, oh, shit, she seemed good. Right, she looked clean. Yeah, she right. looked look clean. clean. Yeah. Smell clean. Yeah, them, them, <laughs> yeah, them the one. So, so that's, <laughs> my, that's my thing, you know. And I could be taking a risk doing that or whatever. I ain't going to lie. But, yeah, you know, the two relationships I had, I went raw dog. Mark Raw Dog Dog. dog. <laughs> Mark, Raw Dog. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it definitely is a rest. But, I mean, we can sit here all day till we blew in the face saying that it, what you should, should be doing. But in real life, dog, couples and relationships ain't using no rubbers. No, that's I why, that's why I'm so many. Right I'm just saying you should. Yeah. You know, like, but I ain't, I know <laughs> personally, because I ain't the only one that like it, bro. I'm telling I mean, you. I mean, me, myself, I've never had unprotected sex. I'm about to slap cuz on camera. I'm about to slap cuz on camera. Hey, I wrap it up, nigga, like they be saying on BET. You wrap, wrap it up. up. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you're supposed to. Yeah, but I think when you <laughs> when you in a relationship, though, you know, I, I, I think it's. <clears throat> I don't want to say this, though. I think when, you, when you're in a relationship, I, I don't want to call it false, but I think it's a, it's a false sense of security. That you know this person, this person is with you and you with them, and yeah. once you build that kind of trust, though, and plus if you if you ever then had uh, unprotected sex, then shit, it's a bitch to go back. Yeah, <laughs> it is. I ain't gonna lie, it's a bitch to go yeah, back. Yeah. I mean, unless, unless like you said, it's just you know something random. Yeah. And when I say random, I don't mean like out here hoeing, but I mean like, like a, layups. Yeah, yeah, layups. <laughs> Speaking of layups, no, I'll talk to you about that later. That's okay. that's the off the air situation. Okay. Uh, no, <laughs> I got no cops. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I I think you should, but in all honesty, most people don't. Though and that's how that's how single single parents. That that's how it happens. Yeah, that's how it happens. If you is in a relationship, man, and you and you raw dog with your girl, whatever, man. I'm gonna need you if you got that. I mean, if you doing that, I'm gonna say I condone it. But if you got your little side piece, your little randoms. <laughs> Don't go in them raw too. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Right. Don't be, don't be raw. Right. I mean, I ain't gonna say you're right for doing it, but you are. That's just. I don't can't be any more disrespectful about cheating. <laughs> yeah. Right. It's even more. Yeah. <laughs> that's like that's like if you married or something, you come on, you smashing your side piece in your in y'all bed. Yeah. yeah that's, oh. that's, that's, that's right. So if you gonna oh. do that, and I, like I said, I ain't saying that's the right thing to do, but uh, make sure you protect it with that, that shit. With ain't that, the right thing to do. Ain't the right thing to do, but a lot of people do it. <laughs> <laughs> that's just the dumb shit. So if your girl, make sure your girl, you know. 
Motherfuckers, if you got side people, be protected on that part. They playing dice with their shits, man. Uh, bros do it too. They play dice with their shits. Because I know, I know playing that my you, nigga you, go wrong everything. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> some of the chicks don't even say nothing. You know and they, yeah, they won't say nothing. They won't yeah. say nothing, True. you know? Mm. Like, I'm like, no, you being here wrong? Yeah. Look, you just married like, last week. <laughs> I mean, a, 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 a large majority of yeah. uh, uh, females do go out like that. Hey, but look, we go. Uh, if you on Ustream, though, don't forget, you gotta give us a call seven six zero two eight three forty six forty seven. Hit that number one key so you can uh, say a comment. If you on, if you on the phone right now, hit that number one key. Don't be scared. But like, if you got HIV or something, we don't want to hear about that. But <laughs> well, I mean, if we know you, we kind of want to know though. Right. So I don't be taking no shots behind you. Shit, I want to know. Period. <laughs> you want to know? Period. I just want to know. <laughs> I just want to know. Nah, we want to hear for we want to hear for ladies though. I want to hear what y'all got to say. But uh, we gonna go to commercial break real quick. But when we get back though, we gonna discuss a couple of uh, we go we gonna see if we got any uh personal experiences, and then we go uh we gonna look into something else about this uh. About just not wrapping up situation, but you gotta come back and check us out right after this commercial. Be back in one minute, four seconds. If you want to form a business, service, product, or engagement that you want to promote, and you're tired of promoting on Facebook, yeah, you can take know. advantage of our yeah. daily growing audience right here at Straight from the E Block. Our radio show is via the internet every Tuesday evening from 6 30 to 7 30 p.m. All you need to do is create an audio file for your commercial and send it to us at flipsideinkpublishing at gmail.com. The clip should not be longer than one minute. It should include enough information to describe what you are selling and where your service, product, or engagement can be found. Log in and listen to Straight from the Blog at www.blogtalkradio.com slash flipside inc or call in at 760-283-4647 every Tuesday at 6.30 p.m. and listen to our high topic and soon your commercial. Check the website for details, oh www.flipside-inc.com. You know what it is, man. We back. Straight from the E-Block, man. In case you just joined us on Ustream or on the phone lines, today's topic, if you're a couple in a relationship, should you still be using a condom? So that's what we're talking about right now. Uh, basically, on, on deck right now, we're saying that you should. You should. <laughs> but the reality of it is that most of us don't. Right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you, you could be in that shit looking at that motherfucker on the dress like. <laughs> Damn. Right. right. I, I should go over there. Get, get that gun. <laughs> but I'm just going to stay right here and get this one. Right. Exactly. Exactly. Hell yeah. Hey, we going we to go to the phone lines, man. See what y'all got to say. Or maybe not. Because, uh, yeah, I guess somebody somebody's phone call just dropped. But um, anyway, saw me. Personal experience though, dog. What, what what y'all think, man? So in a relationship, yo your personal experience been like you start off with a rubber, but then it just fade away. It fade. It fade. It fade, like, <laughs> fade like Mike. Like how do you uh but, how do you make that decision? Like when when do you make that decision? When you when you feel like like yeah. hopefully she ain't fucking nobody like, else, you, or yeah, and you ain't going you ain't fuck nobody else. You know what I'm saying? So if, but if you are then then don't do it. Hell no. I mean, I mean, or, or you just make sure you wear the condom with, like with, I said, the, with, with the side yeah, piece. Definitely, definitely with the side piece. I mean, I wear a condom. When I'm single, man, I was single, uh, condoms all day, you know, all day, yeah. you know what I'm saying? But oh, yeah, for sure. I, I get the, oh, man, I'm, ooh, baby, I like it. Rock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, first, like I said, if I start off with that, then after a while, I guess, after, like you say, after the trust, then you get to know that person, I guess you start believing that you can go in and raw. Yeah. 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 Yeah, so how are females supposed to trust the dude? I don't know. That's what we try to find yeah. out. It's, it ain't nothing but dudes sitting here. Right. Like, you we, try to, we try to get some of You ain't saying nothing. Right. right. You ain't saying nothing. I'm just saying. Gigi oh. got a lot of shit on her man today. Okay. All right. So, so, so tell me what you think, man. I mean, Condoms with, uh, with, the, with the relationship or what? I mean, with the relationship, of course. I mean, reality is if you in, you know, you in it to win it at a point in time it come off and it just be that trust factor yeah but i mean if you get like that one somebody i mean y'all not in a relationship but it's been about uh four five good months i mean what's what's the deal <laughs> right I, I don't know Sounds sounds personal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sounds you, personal. I, I don't know as a female you still gotta like protect yourself at all costs because 
Niggas be double backing and you know saying I ain't no, I ain't doing this, that's I why ain't you doing sh- that. That's yeah. why you should. Exactly, Where's that's that? why you should. Yeah. But how can you ever know when you know it's all right when it's safe? Yeah, I guess I guess the bottom line is it ain't never really safe. It I guess, really safe. I guess so that's where, the bottom line. So where, so where the motherfucker? Yeah, it sounds good. Hey, we <laughs> we're not full of shit. Yeah. <laughs> we gonna go back to the uh, to the phone lines. Y'all see what y'all got to say. Uh, if, don't forget if you on you stream, you gotta give us a call seven six zero two eight three forty six forty seven and hit that number one key so you can come on live with your comment. Uh, going back to the phone lines though, I got three one three. Three zero four. You on live straight from the E block. I'll let your boy. What up, though? No, so I'm trying to. Are you asking the question? Do you use a condom when you're married because of protection from an STD, or use a condom as a contraceptive when you're married? Uh, either either one. Either one. Should you be using the condom? If period. If, if you're wearing a condom when you're married and saying I'm wearing this because I'm not sure if she's been straight, divorce her, bro. Don't even. <laughs> 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 I feel you, dog. If you're kids, you don't want to have. Yes, sir, kind of, but if you're like, man, I don't know what she did last night, bro. That's not your wife. <laughs> right. Now, now we're we we not necessarily just talking about in a marriage. I mean, just like in a, in a relationship. Period. Well, you gotta think she's doing the same thing you are. So if you're straight, then she's being just as straight as you. But if you're doing something behind her back, yeah, we're kind of she's doing the same thing as you. Yeah, <laughs> I guess that's that's one way to look at it. Yeah. And so, what about you? You, <laughs> you you practice you practice what you preach. I practice celibacy because of that. No, that's that's what's up. Yeah, yeah, that's a yeah, tough thing to do. Yeah, big big ups, cuz. <laughs> All right, hey, that's what's up. Good good, good luck with that. Yeah, this is the first time you watched the show, man. I love it. I think thanks for taking my call. Oh, that's, that's what's up, up man. Good thanks luck. for calling in. Good looking out, big um. Yeah. Yep. Good hey, that's what's up, man. Celibacy. Celibacy. Yeah. I mean, right? I know people, a lot of people clown that jump, but dog, nowadays. The way shit is, you shit feel me? Shit is fucked up. Yeah. Fucked yeah. up. Like, yeah. And you thought it was just the niggas, but it's the females out here, too. Yeah. Uh, I ain't just the niggas trying to smash everybody. Yeah, the girls the they out here trying to smash hey, everybody, too. Me niggas on Friday. Not all females. So, uh, some females. Some, some females. <laughs> like 80%. <laughs> right. 85. <laughs> like, this how niggas seem like it's all about like niggas do all this dirt and shit. Females do the same type oh, of man, shit. Oh man, they do the same they thing. Want some, if they, not more. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They want, they want some shit like we want some shit. They're like cats. They sneaky than them motherfuckers. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, while we talking about, you know what I'm saying? While we talking about uh, relationships and, and using protection and shit like that. I always got to go to the one thing. Um, we got a caller on day, but uh, I'm going to get back to y'all one second, caller. I just want to say this. As much as women talk about this, that, or the third, dog, how many girls have you been with that when it's getting ready to go down, they ain't even mentioning the condom? Like, if I ain't go for my shit, then yeah, we, we I'd have just been hitting that uh, shit wrong. Uh, well, okay, the, the girl I mess with now and stuff, that was the first person I actually, like, had one on deck for me. Yeah. So I'm like, oh shit. Yeah, right. Yeah. right. She's I, a winner. Yeah, yeah. Right, right, She's right. a keeper. Switch. Right. We get smashed with uh, raw, raw, raw dog. See, see, that, ain't no, <laughs> that ain't no layup, though. You know, we yeah, know yeah, that yeah. show you right there. She's like, that ain't no layup. Yeah, so I mean, yeah. that's the only time that ever happened to me, though. <laughs> the only time. Yeah, only time. Hey, we we going to go back to the, uh, to the phone lines real quick. I got a. Uh, Three one three seven four two. You on live straight from the E block? I'll let your boy. What up, though? What's up, What's going on, y'all? What's, What's going up? on? What up, though? And top of the day is what? If you in a uh, if you in a relationship, should you still be using condoms? Sure, why not? Cause you you have no idea. You don't even have a clue what the other person is doing until some shit pop off. Yeah, but I mean, you don't have so a clue what the other person doing even when you married. Yeah. You're right. You're right. So it should be a a a a, a regular thing with with married couples because you don't know. You yeah. don't know. But but I'm not gonna say, well, okay, okay, babe. Guess what I just did. Guess what I did. <laughs> hey, hey, but but I just look. Went out and I just did the thing thing with the one thing. Thing thing with the one thing <laughs> with the one thing. Hey, but what what look? You know. So then what? Oh man, that's crazy. Yeah, but you already know that that for for a woman, that's gonna be uh, what you call that's that's gonna be a trust issue. Like yeah, yeah. if I if I all of a sudden start I mean, using right, rubbers with you, but see, most married couples agree on condoms. 
But look, what those is, couples that have been together over, you know, for a lot of years mm-hmm. agree on condoms. So that means you're agreeing on it. It's much stuff popping off on the outside of the household. Yeah, you think? Just I mean, because you agree on condoms? I mean, say- but but I st- I think if I come right now and say, hey baby, hey baby, we should wear condom. Nigga, she finna go through your phone. Hell yeah. She about to follow you to work. Yeah. Hell yeah. Nigga. Yeah. You been wrong yeah. yeah. condoms? condoms? Yeah, no, 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 no. But I, so what she saying? Yeah, that means that if you use a condom, that means that you. I mean, y'all should have an op- uh, open marriage. Yeah, yeah. See now, now if y'all you had an open marriage and y'all was swingers. Then you better wear other wear Yeah, this conversation just went to a whole other level, didn't it? Swingers. <laughs> you know? Damn. I mean, I'm just saying. Yeah, I, obviously you just you, you know, just said you just, something. You just said it. Like, <laughs> <right>. <laughs> you know, because you know, like I said, I was swingers then, okay, then you wouldn't have a choice but to wear. Because you don't know what the other couple is doing. But y'all at one You couple, know what the other couple I mean, is doing. So you agree on something like that. <laughs> You definitely know what the other couple is doing. I don't know. That, that's what's up, though. So, uh-huh. so have have you been in a have you been in a relationship where you, where you still use condoms? No. <laughs> <laughs> right. But I can. That's, it wouldn't be a problem if he came to me and said, "Okay, we need to start." Oh, okay. So right now, yeah, y'all not using condoms. If he come to you and say, "Let's start using," them, you cool with that? You ain't gonna have no problem. No. What? That means, that means I can go outside. That means I can go outside. That's giving me that's giving me a privilege to go outside. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just hang up on me? No, I ain't. That that gives me the privilege to go outside. Hey, so what's the point of being in a relationship? If you, no, yeah. that gives you the privilege to go to the doctor and make sure you slip. I mean, you right, right. you're right, you're right. It wouldn't be. Well, there would be no point. Uh, right. you have, that's just something that you have to agree on with your other half. Yeah. Then if the agreement don't work, then it's going to be really a trust issue because that's always going to come up in an argument. Always, always. Man. All right. Okay. That's what's up, though. Appreciate the call. Thanks for your call, though, babe. All right, and you know they got uh, invisible lubricant too, so that wouldn't be a problem either. <laughs> invisible lubricant? Really? I don't know. What that is. All right. Yeah. All right, we go. We go. Go. We go. Google it. Super <laughs> spermicide. Fillers. Fillers. Google that. Fillers. All right, bet. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, for real, like a liquid invisible rubber. Yeah. I don't think I want that shit on my dick, though. Yeah. <laughs> that's yeah. a poor conscious stuff, though. That's not going to protect you from no STD. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, that's what it is? There's no baby. No baby. Yeah. Like, hey, so women be knowing about all that shit. Don't be telling us, huh? <laughs> hey, like, no, you know, I know about all this, but go ahead and just put that shit in me wrong, though. Yeah, yeah. We don't know shit. You yeah, don't. That's, that's that whole conscious stuff thing. So you know what you know before you know. <laughs> <laughs> You know, or the the more we talk to uh two G's in the back, man, I think there's something yes, sort of personal going on. Right? Yes, it is. Angry woman, man. <laughs> <laughs> she saw she got an attitude, man. Yes, hey, look, if you uh <laughs> if you on you street right now, you want to give us a call seven six zero two eight three forty six forty seven. Hit that number one key so you can comment on today's uh, it's topic. Like, it's like that one call that was saying like. Uh, in, in, in a relationship, whenever you use condoms, that means that you cheating. I mean, basically, that's how she was saying that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, my right. thing is, what well, if you just want to make sure you come into the relationship, nigga, clean? Nigga, like I said, like I said, I know a couple that's that's I I know devoted and and, and loving, and they use condoms, bro, just yeah. because. Yeah, maybe niggas don't want to pull out. Yeah. <laughs> right, right. Put, pull, pull out on method already. Right, right. I'm saying like he's in a situation now. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. And, uh, I don't know. But what about uh so like what what if it's let let let's look at every every verse since we can't get no ladies to call in really to really give us no insight. Uh what if it's us and we using rubbers and then no we not using rubbers and all of a sudden she decided we should use we should use one. We're gonna be um it's gonna be a problem. Bu- we're gonna be in the bushes. Looking at her house, <laughs> climbing, 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 climbing the walls and shit like Spider Man, trying yeah. to look in her apartment or her crib. You know, what I'm but that's be something that just to be starting off. Like we had that one topic, dog. 
about the whole sex thing, all of a sudden you just say, I ain't gonna have sex no more. Yeah, yeah. I've been smashed for four months. Yeah, you go all night and think something I've been wrong dogging you since day one. Yeah. And now, nigga, a year later, you wanna use a condom. Yeah. Right. What the fuck? You see a movie at schedule or something? Right. <laughs> <laughs> that could happen, though. Yeah, that yeah, shit yeah. good happen. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, my friend just told me a story. Like, 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 she like, fucked up. Yeah, and, yeah, you know, you come with some real shit. You know what I'm saying, man? Yeah. Yeah. We can talk about that shit. You know what I'm saying? We can honestly sit down and talk about it. But you said, all right, we got your condoms. You got to put this on. What? <laughs> you looking at that motherfucker like a foreign what? object, like, what's this? I'm going to instantly start choking shit out your ass. <laughs> yeah, just yeah. off real. Just what, start choking. What's that nigga name? What's his name? <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. <nah. laughs> Way to be a little crazy. Yeah. A woman don't have to be unfaithful to give you nothing either. If she a dirty trifling little something, she can give you something too, so. Yeah. Don't make it all on being faithful. Yeah. That is true. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, so I'm for real though, what, what you mad about, man? Tell us what's on your mind. What? I know it's too much. That's a whole other segment. That's a whole other segment. Shit, we got time. We got, well, we got about 20 minutes. We can listen to you. You know what I'm saying? You want to cry about it. You know what I'm saying? This is a good place to cry about it. Right, but, uh, there ain't no punk. Ain't no punk. <laughs> hey, it's a... Uh, Hey, real quick though, man. It's uh, it's Tweet Me Tuesday, so we go, we gonna do a, uh, we gonna do a tweet check real quick. See what we got popping off right here, man. I don't know if, I don't know if this clown got a, a real, a real shout out of that, man. But as usual, dog, too many, too many mentions, dog. I, I never single, single nobody out, man. So it's all love to everybody that follow me. At they call me shot. Thanks for all the mentions, all two hundred of them. Oh, you got 200 just yeah, today? Yeah, it's 200. It's low today, man. It's, oh, that's low. All right. Yeah, it's all love. <laughs> all right, so <laughs> anyway, now we got to do a couple of shout outs, man. I'm a, uh, let me see. I'm going to give a shout out to my whole uh, Michigan Writers Network crew. I got, uh, oh, that's me. I got J. Paul Ghetto 63. I got L.A. Jefferson, Monica M. Jones, uh, my girl Fifi, uh, Rosie D. XOXO. Sylvia Hubbard one, uh, and my boy Holla K Green. All right, we go get him a little shout out. And as always, man, I gotta give my my squad a shout out. Uh, Team Gasson, uh, hold it down on the east side, west side, south field, everywhere. I uh, got my girl Sugar 08, Chase West, Miss Lexi, so sexy. Uh, let me see, it's, it's another one of them too. I can't think of her name though. Oh, Music Fanatic 83. Yeah, cause it's a whole whole gang you know, popping off. All right, so we back. If y'all on Twitter, don't forget. To hit up your boys on Twitter, Hood Howard Stern. Please hit up Real Monk Money because he ain't never got no tweets on deck. Never. And hit my man, they call me Shot. Hey, uh, <laughs> What's up? I'm, I'm, I'm about to go back to the topic. No, go ahead, huh? That's have what we you, doing. Have you ever had uh, a female tell you take your, the, the condom off? Mm. Like, just take that shit off. <laughs> I, I don't mean, think so. I mean, I have, like, when well, I was in a relationship with yeah, you, I was so long. Real. <laughs> Right off rip. Like, I just, or, or she just be like, I don't, I ain't feeling that right now. Be like, old girl on uh, on lottery ticket, pull yeah. off the rub, like, uh uh-uh. uh. Like, what you doing? I'm allergic to latex. Right. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. I'm going to swell up. Yeah, okay. Yeah, because I never had that happen. Really. You never had that happen? No, I ain't. Too much came on my, my head. No, I ain't never had that happen. But shit, I think at that point, I don't know. I think at that point when, yeah. when she almost making it too urgent, for me to take that motherfucker off, it's a problem. Red. A, nigga be, Red. a nigga be in the middle of beating something up and you be like, man, fuck this. Take right, it off. yeah, that might happen, yeah. But if she talking about take that motherfucker off, then it's, it's an <laughs> ulterior motive. Yes. I take yes. this off, nigga. And I ain't really into <laughs> ulterior motives. Nah, me either, me either, me either. Right. I think my mama calling me. <laughs> <laughs> I think I hear her right think now. Think mom's calling Yeah, I hear mama calling me. <laughs> right. Nah, but um, I don't know. I think... uh. See, my whole thing is this, though. Relationships, at least at least for dudes anyway, this this is how we look at it, I think. Now, <laughs> women always, I won't say always, but women are more programmed to want to get married than dudes, I, I believe. Uh, there's some dudes. There's some dudes, are, they're just really trying to get married. But to us, it's like you've been with somebody for four or five years. It's like you're getting to marry anyway. anyway. So we that's what we always say, right? It's like we married anyway, so... What's the difference? Like, you got a ring or, or not a ring or whatever. Right, right, right. So, in, in that aspect, I mean, you couldn't you couldn't expect the, you couldn't expect the dude to still be using a rubber. I mean, because if you got kids in the this relationship <laughs> in four years, you ain't gonna how 
What the fuck? Going back to that shit. What the fuck? Man. The first month. So. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, unless unless you didn't have two and, and she yeah. just really don't want no more, no kids, and yeah. nobody want to get that shit snipped. Yeah, yeah. that'd be yeah. the case. That'd be the case. Yeah. Yeah. You would wear them condoms. Yeah. Cause you ain't trying to have no more kids running around this mother. You already got six. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> right. I'm done. Well, what about when you get in a situation when you ain't even? Thinking about you about to smash the girl, you go to the crib and she just ready to smash it. You ain't ready. What you gonna you gonna say? Oh, Stole I'm run. That <laughs> what that Trey song say. Stole Stole run. run. Yeah, yeah, yeah go. but you know, there's it's plenty of kids Can't out here to. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and I was just gonna say, there's plenty of kids out here to prove that most niggas don't make the no, store run. <laughs> nah, yeah. so since we talking about that, dog, let, let's dive into that real quick. You know what I'm saying? Callers, don't get scared. You can comment, dog. If you're on Ustream, don't forget you got to hit us up, 760-283-4647. If you're already on the phone line, hit that number one key and speak up. You know what I'm saying? Speak out. <laughs> but, uh, no, nah, since we're talking about that, man, we're going to dive into this real quick. So, how about you not in a relationship, but y'all are talking, and it looked like it's going into a relationship. Have you ever been in one of those situations where you ain't never used a rubber? Like, period, like, you he went in the first time and just took that chance and then was just like, fuck it from there? Okay. No. Go. Hey, you gonna go? You gonna go first. <laughs> 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 Nobody <laughs> wanna speak up on this. Nobody wanna speak up on this shit. We keep real on the show. Yeah, we keep real on the show. I'm gonna keep it real. Right, keep it real, which? Uh, my son, Mom. Mm -hmm. We never used no condom. Yeah. I lied to her how her starting to say the condom broke. Yeah, and you know me, I didn't believe that shit. Yeah, so I went in, being a youngster, whatever, didn't use no condom. I was ready to get it in. <laughs> it, you know what I'm saying? So I got it in after the first you know, three or four times when I was a spec, you know, she was a specter. So we never ever used one. Yeah. And we didn't use one up until her... <laughs> Her insurance couldn't cover it. The <laughs> <laughs> shot no more. Hell no. So I did, I'm like, uh, yeah, we gonna get these condoms. We agreed together to we'll get the condoms there. Like, what the fuck? For real. I keep real, dog. Hey, keep real. So, that's, that's, my son was three years old once we first started using condoms. <laughs> <laughs> the insurance couldn't cover the shot no more. Right. <laughs> That's, that's okay, up. listen, nigga. She gonna be like, "What you whole ass nigga?" <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's the truth, though. That's what it was. Hey, yeah, the truth will set you free. You use no condoms in there, though. No, up? me though. <laughs> I have though. No, I've I've went in there to her around because <laughs> she was a virgin. Yeah. You know, my sister. And I'm figuring like, shit, she ain't got nothing. I ain't really did nothing. So you know, yeah. I start off my situation. My whole situation not like that. <laughs> 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 right. no, at the beginning, just virgin. I ain't really did my stick in that. Fuck it, I'm taking that shot. Fuck it, I'm doing this shit. Stab in the dark. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, long we on roll crap. So remember I said I was a virgin? Like, oh uh, uh, shit. Shit. Uh, Hell no. Craig just told me. Ah oh, no. What about you, GG in the back? You ain't got nothing to say about that. Damn! <laughs> who, who does that? Not me. Oh, oh okay. Oh, <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> As a woman, I can stand here and admit that I done had slips up or one or two, but I mean, going in off rib, like, come on now, that that's 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 when you have to like chalk it up, like, okay, well, baby, next time, you know, or you high heated, if you ain't ready to make no store run or nothing like that. As a female, you know, a lady, I know I'm keep my own, but if I know what's about to go down before you even get there and I know I don't have none, I'm going to shoot that tag so I'm going to have that conversation with you like, oh, right. look, uh, I'm going right. to get something because I'm hot, I'm ready. Right. Little Caesars. You know what the deal is. Oh, uh, hot and ready. Yeah, <laughs> yeah so... <laughs> I'm going to skip myself on that one, and then we're going to get into uh, something uh, else. Uh, <laughs> okay. I told you about my damn nigga. Uh, I, 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 <laughs> he, he better say it because I'm going to say it. <laughs> damn. <laughs> I, I, I'm just really? Into, yeah, because, you, you know, we all told our little stories. And shit. You all right. Well, I may or may not have okay. done that once or twice. <laughs> maybe. All right. I mean, I, yeah, once. 
Yeah, twice. Yeah, twice. I know one situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's two, two situations here. Yeah, yeah, yeah the one from the phone, and yeah, the yeah. one like yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But but the thing about those though, like I mean, not to not to really you know what I'm saying to to uh to justify or not, but even though it it was like you know the the first time and no I didn't use a rubber, but the thing was is that even though we hadn't been in a relationship both times. We had been in a relationship. I had been knowing him for so long before that point. Exactly. It's like, damn, might as well have been in a relationship. Yeah, shit. Yeah. Cause I've been knowing him for so long anyway. So that's how I justify that. And that's how I sleep at night without like shaking to death, being scared and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Do people really go down there? Like, do you know anybody before a relationship actually go and get tested for get like, HIV and, and AIDS and all that stuff? Nah, like, unless, you, unless you just get lucky and just happen to catch a motherfucker after they just got tested. Like, I don't think nobody do it on purpose. Yeah. Like, yeah, you know, I'm going to let that nigga hit this. I'm going to go down and get tested. Like, I, yeah, I, I've just been in a situation before where, you know, I might have had just, by coincidence, had just went and got tested. You know what I'm saying? So, so you had the phone? What, been tested? Yeah, yeah sure. I've been tested twice. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah, that shit ain't no joke, nigga. I don't play around. Hey, though, I'm going to tell you. Yeah, every hey. time, yeah. Whenever you, um, they take blood, you can have some t- um, check. check. Yes. No, I'm going to tell you one situation when I got tested, right? Mm. I'm going to go to there and you know, she do her thing, this and that. The bra bring me back in the office. Right there, I'm shaking like dying life. Like, I'm shaking like a motherfucker, right? I'm shaking and shit. She's like, you want some candy? I'm like, no, I don't want no candy. Bitch, I don't know what's going on. Right? Yeah. I'm shaking like dying life. She's like, well, um... I'm like, come on. She is actually prolonged and shit. Uh-huh. She's like, yeah. She fucking with yeah, you. Yeah, just fucking with me, yeah. dog. So I'm like, yeah, did that scare you? Yeah, that's scared. She's like, give me these condoms. I'm out of here. Give me this bag. She gave me this big ass bag. <laughs> <laughs> big ass bag of condoms. I got that long, man. You scared the, the living shit out of me, lady. Hell you know what I'm saying? She's sitting out there prolonging it. That's that life sentence, man. Man, psh, I'm shaking like nine knots, dog. She's like, uh, you want some candy? No. Like, she's finna break me some news, some bad news. Right. <laughs> Offer me some fucking candy. You got a gun, bitch? <laughs> you got a gun? <laughs> 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 you got that pistol. Why you got that pistol? Cause you tell me this shit. Open off, muscle. <laughs> Damn. Well, that, that's how you. That's how you feel. Though. That's how you think. When like when you get tested, dog, it's like all of a sudden you start thinking about yeah, yeah. all the all dumb all shit. The shit you done like you knew it was dumb then. Yeah. But it don't come to reality yeah. until you about to get that test, yeah. boy. Yeah. Yeah. What, what was that one movie or that show when they was thinking about the people they slept with and the people that person slept with? Yeah. And so on and so on. That shit reminded me of that movie Kids. Oh, that was terrible. Yeah, that was yeah. terrible. That, movie. that yeah. was a terrible yeah. movie. That shit is wicked. A lot of kids. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, the truth is, though, man, like, uh, you know, the reports from the CDC, for whatever reason, I don't know why, but they, they don't have no new numbers since 2008, and I don't know why that is. Unless I just couldn't find them, but uh, nigga, it's a, it's a lot of it's a lot of African Americans that's infected, dog. Uh, between was it fifteen? No, not fifteen. Seventeen and uh, I want to say was it twenty five? Somewhere twenty five, twenty six, somewhere in there. Like the it's it's just it's crazy. And, and what's funny about it, or not funny about it, but the the weird thing about it is the majority of women though. Yeah. Uh, I was trying to figure out how that shit's working yeah. though. Who they fucking to get it then? Yeah, <laughs> the majority women. Yeah, like yeah. I, I don't get it. Yeah, so unless it's just I guess it's dudes just transmitted to, to yeah. Yeah, numerous you know numerous chicks. Right. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I mean that's what they say too. Yeah. That a lot of it is like that. That download shit, man. Yeah. Hey, you some coward bitches, man. You gonna fuck a dude? <laughs> fuck a dude and stay with. Just stay dude. with him. Quit fucking. Right, quit fucking right. on my pool. Right. Quit front, man. <laughs> right. You put my fucking port. You putting sharks in the goddamn pool. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? How am I supposed to go swimming in this pool? Yeah, I'm looking at all these sharks. Yeah, yeah. But we still keep going swimming, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Splash. Right. <laughs> Cut <Cannibal>! him <laughs> He said Splash. Hey, <laughs> right, look, man. You got, <laughs> you got about eight minutes, man. If you all, if you all use stream, you can give us a call at 760-283-4647. If you're on the phone line right now, Go ahead and hit that number one key. Tell us what's on your mind. If you're in a relationship, should you still be using the condom? Like I say, you, you definitely should be. Definitely should I guess be. only because 
not just the whole thing of getting pregnant, but I mean the the, the real thing now is just all these damn diseases, yeah. man. Huh. And all these all these trifling. And I ain't gonna say men or women. I'm saying all these trifling people uh -huh. who. Who like knowingly transmitting shit? Yeah, That's dog. just trifling. Like, right? You know you got the package. You ain't gonna think about wearing no condom. You just gonna fucking kill this person, dog. Man. And I think them people should go to jail and get a own little population in jail for AIDS, and motherfuckers. Just, just fuck each other. That's, <laughs> that's, that's attempted murder, cuz. It is, it is. And not even just AIDS, because I, I had the experience where I had to talk to one of my little god sisters. She, the little boy, had his penis pierced. So she felt like, oh, I'm mad at the world, let him fuck him. I'm about to go get myself clean, get my antibiotics. And I'm not gonna tell him. I said, don't do that. Because nah, number one, he gonna give it to somebody else. He gonna give it to somebody else. Two, you young, you stupid. You gonna end up fucking back with him, and uh -huh. you gonna reinfect your own dumb ass. Hell yeah, so that is he, true. Uh, you know, being a daughter body, y'all, y'all did what y'all did. And you know, hey, he gotta go to Herman Kiefer, whatever y'all gotta do, go. Just go get it done. Get, yeah. You know, taken care of. You just better be lucky in something that can be cured. Hell yeah, yeah for real. Yeah, for real. But no, yeah, that that is true though. Yeah. yeah, like if you right, if you if you get infected, man, you better tell yeah. the 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 last nigga you smashed or whatever. So, cause like you said, that's just looking out for other people though. But that's what's wrong with society. Period though, yeah. don't nobody want to look out for nobody though. Nobody. I be seeing some nasty shit like niggas be all up on Matt Pitt on those motherfucking toops and shit, man. What this motherfucker? I know you got girl part the crib. These niggas be like nigga. Regular niggas like me and John, we were thinking, dog. Uh, I be seeing yeah. them, I'm like, these niggas crazy. Yeah, shit, I, <laughs> that shit wild, dog. I, I don't really know. That shit just, that shit just, yeah. Now, especially, that's that's real bold, though, if, like, if y'all, I, I can understand how that situation can happen, too, though. Because, like, if y'all in a relationship or something, and you bring something back to the relationship, she get infected, of course, just like she was saying earlier, she gonna be so pissed that she probably gonna go get herself fixed and just let you burn and shit. And if you out here stepping out on her ass anyway, you gonna end up giving it to somebody yeah, else. Yeah. I mean, that shit just gonna keep going around. Like you, you could be the one to prevent it. Yeah. But a lot of people, a lot of people have that power to prevent shit and won't and even won't do, do it. it. Yeah. Hey. I mean, that's what's, that's in society. Period. That's yeah. It? That's in it's everything. Society, in everything. In everything. Dog. Yeah, I mean, sure. motherfuckers have the power to do shit that you know to make a change. And and they don't. Look yeah. at all these motherfucking calls. Well, like, like, <laughs> right. 725. If y'all go together and get it taken care of, ain't no way, you know, you you be a dummy, you go back to him or whatever, and he like, yeah, I went and got it taken care of, and really didn't. So right. my thing is, go get it knocked out, you know, yeah. together Look at or that whatever. Whether y'all gonna be together or not. Y'all was together when y'all got it, evidently. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, so, exactly. I mean, what the fuck is there to be ashamed of now? Yep. Yep. Exactly. So go ahead and get it, you know, taken care of, so that way you won't reinfect yourself. He not out there, you know, pumping on this one and that one. And exactly. Right, burning up the city. <laughs> right, burning up the city. <laughs> that shit is scary, though, dog. Really? Like, as much as sex is, is, is enjoyable. And good and whatever, <laughs> whatever you want to call it, it dog. Like yeah. I think me you talking about that shit, dog. Like nigga, sometimes you don't have to smash everything. Oh, that's the truth. That's yeah. the truth. And I think some niggas, some yeah. niggas don't. Yeah. Don't. <laughs> yeah. 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 Gigi clapping yeah. up in the back. I don't remember. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You 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 do not have to smash <laughs> everything though. It's yeah. okay. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. it's okay to turn it down. It was you know when I first got my relationship, it was a girl, man. I was feeling her. But the more I, I was around her, I seen different niggas she was messing with. Was I had my chance to smash? I just passed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. smash and pass. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, you crazy? You smashed on that? Yeah, dog. What's wrong with you? Nigga, I just smashed. Yeah. Uh, I just I just pat pat real quick, dog. Hey, I'm trying yeah. to tell you, what you learn when you yeah. get older yeah. about yeah. that yeah. shit. And that's what's wrong with a lot of people. That's what I be talking about. Yeah, motherfuckers going to dip in the air. Yeah, I be talking about brother and just just seeing how these young girls and niggas is, man. It's too many people fucking different people, dog. Like. Nigga, yeah. that's, they, that's they whole that's on their agenda for the week. Nigga, Friday I'm gonna meet somebody. I'm smashing my Sunday. <laughs> right. And then smashing my Saturday. And, and that's how they say it. Smashing Friday yeah, night. Right, yeah. some yeah. Niggas, and some people smash different people every weekend. Yeah. yeah. yeah like yeah. this girl told me, dog, true story. She blamed it on the college life and said, since I ain't go out on campus, I wanna understand. She had over thirty sex partners, nigga. She was only like 21, 22. Yeah. Thirty. And I'm like, dip talk, you know what I'm saying? Shy, you ain't never been, he wasn't on college campuses, staying on campus. Yeah, I understand. I know. Damn. Damn. I understand. You had to have like, you had to have like, a couple of them at the same time. Get that I said, like, <laughs> at 21? Well, I mean, she, they had 21, I mean, she had been there for three years. That's 10 a year, right? <laughs> <laughs> I said, we're going to go to the phone line. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to 
gonna go to the phone lines real quick. Don't forget, man. You got like a, you got like five minutes. So if you on U Stream, you gotta hit us up seven six zero two eight three forty six forty seven. Hit that number one key if you're on the phone lines right now, so we holler at you. Uh, let's go to the phone lines. I got three one. That look like angry man, dog. That yeah, is. Damn, yeah, he, Damn he gonna be pissed off because he been on hold for a minute. I got a three one three seven four zero. You on live? Straight from the E block. I'll let your boy. What up, dog? What up, man? What up, dog? Hey, you know what? I, I I think this is my last time telling y'all. Uh, I think this is my last time telling y'all. I'm talking so damn much and get to the car. Y'all can do all this after the show is over. Y'all need to be prompted when I call. Tell old girl to get, get the point in, get it in, keep it moving. I'm not going to keep doing this, man. You know what I'm saying? I got somebody else that want to get in on the phone call real special, and y'all take it all of my time. But back to the topic. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm coming in doing it because why? Because it makes sense. Doing that, I mean, why, why, I mean, why don't you go up and get any girl wrong? And you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? The, the president cheat. So I can just tell you what I'm saying about it. I mean, I mean, what are we supposed to do out here? You know what I'm saying? You know, black men, black, black men really don't take care of their kids anyway, so, you know, let's prevent that from jump. But you know what? Y'all might want to holler at me. going to end up with you this time, but you know, you I'm going to pass you on to somebody real special. You might enjoy this next caller. All right. I think the only thing to do is to go ahead. <laughs> and buy those things so that you don't have problems later on down the road. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, what, that's how you feel? We, we, we are supposed to practice <laughs> safe sex. Yeah, I, and this is safe as you're going to get unless you buy a box of balloons. <laughs> That's what's up. Hey, so, so you should definitely be using the condom still, huh? I'm sorry? So you should definitely still be using the condom if you're in a relationship, huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. I feel it, it should be. Now, look, if you're not ready to go into a relationship and say, well, look, we're going to have kids and all that, blah, blah, blah. Okay, go, go do what you're going to do. But if you say, no, we're not going to handle kids. Not right away. Okay, well then, save you some grief and save the lady some grief because if you have a little rug wreck, somebody got to pay. Yeah, 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 that's the truth. Yeah, somebody yeah, I, got to I, I can't disagree with that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now, I work too hard as it is paying for these rug rats and I ain't got them, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to leave them on my doorstep and stuff. Like that. <laughs> yeah, you got a nice looking house with that. <laughs> I hear you. Yeah. Okay, that's the only thing. I mean, it's safe sex, cool. Sex is cool. But if you don't practice, practice. Yeah. Uh, don't be out there going for the real magenta and end up with a whole lot of kids on the hand and you don't want none of them. Yeah. <laughs> that's what's up. Yeah. <laughs> that's what's up, dog. All right. Hey, I, I appreciate hey. your call, though. And you're quite welcome. Anytime you need a little education on this stuff, just give me a call. That's okay. what's up. I'm going to hold you to that. Okay. <laughs> All right. Now. Yeah. Like you say. Like, <laughs> you say, if you go practice, you practice, huh? Somebody going to have to pay. Yeah, you're and right, that's though. What, that's what friends of the cunt come in there and ask. Yeah, you know, friends, friends, of cunt. Cunt. Yeah. friends of the cunt. Friends of the cunt, huh? Hey, that a bitch. Friends yeah. of the cunt. Hey, so, man, I guess we go. We gonna wrap it on up out here, dog. <laughs> no point intended, no I guess. We gonna wrap it up. And the shit, a point intended. Right. Man. Hey, so I guess what we got on deck is pretty much, man. You should be, huh? You should be. Yeah. Yeah, but the reality is, that most people ain't. Yeah, but you know, we still, <laughs> yeah, still got anyway. You know, <laughs> right. Still got drilling into these motherfuckers' heads, man. Yeah, for sure, though. Especially, yeah. especially the younger generation. I ain't trying to say that. You know, what I'm saying we done got older and we don't have to do the same things, but the younger generation got to got. Yeah, they got a little bit more going on yes, than we bro. do. Yes, yeah, they, they do. do. No, you should have condoms, bro. Yeah. In your day and age, dog, it's a lot of shit going on, dog. Like sure. you know, my mama and them day and age, they could have did whatever, who they would do whatever, because there wasn't no AIDS and all that shit, whatnot. Yeah. You know? It was BD. It was BD. Right. They got BD. Right, right. Hell no. It wasn't all that shit. So, you know what I'm saying? Y'all wrap it up, man. Yeah, ain't ain't sure. no wrong with being safe, baby. No, nah, it really ain't, man. It, it saved you some. some some, some pain and some money in the long money, run. Hell yeah, because you don't want to see friends of the cut. <laughs> friends of the cut. You don't want to deal with them. Man, on that note, I guess we're going to be up out here, man. Real quick, though, I just want to give one more shout-out 
to my girl Coco graduating this Saturday. Congratulations, baby, doing your thing. You feel me? Hey, we up out of here, though, man. You know what it is. Straight from the E block. It's your boy, the hood, Howard Stern, Q Lewis. Monk Money. Y'all shout out to Hot Topic. Fuck! Yeah, he actually had a hot topic today, though. That's what's up. We up out of here, dog. I do this. Subscribe to you, nigga. No beats. Gotta get together. I'm getting older now. I can't let time pass me down. People trying to hold me down, but I'm never giving up. My mind struggles day to day. Gotta make a way. Niggas say I can't do better. Fuck what niggas gotta say. It's only me, but fuck it. I'ma still make it out. Crying every day. I'm still struggling with my life about. No matter what I'm faced with, I'm still going on. Through the pressure and pain, I'm still staying strong. I just let these niggas talk and still do me. My grind never stop, nigga. I'm supposed to be. Didn't have shit Got on my grind On my hustle I ain't stopping shit So many niggas Walked away And couldn't help me out And now I'm seeing What my real niggas All about You see I did it On my own Fighting every day Bro no money Maintain Still made a way Cause you can never Hold a real last nigga down I got my head To the sky Feet to the ground I had to make a way Struggle too many years Pissed off at myself Cause I see my mouth in tears Living check by check For bullshit Hey I promise I'm gonna make it right, I'm gonna make a way And you don't have to do a thing, just sit and chill And you will never have to worry about the fucking bills I put that on my life, everything gonna be alright I know it's dark right now, but we gon' see a light I'm trying to make it out of my I'm on the front.